going on, everybody? Welcome to the RLC TV college football live stream, man. We going to be streaming this game today. Game of the day is um Oregon versus Arbor Tigers, man. And um, shout out to these two teams because finally we got two teams that decide to play somebody today. You know, everybody else just been playing cupcakes, man, and um. <clears throat> nobody want to play nobody, man. That's why I say Miami Hurricanes, man. It doesn't matter. Um, we, we take on anybody, anytime. You see, um, our first game, we went up against the Gators. Even though we fell short, 24 to 20, but it's all good. At least we wasn't playing no cupcake team, you know? Um, so shout out to everybody that's out there um, that's getting ready to watch the game. You know, we're going to be going live streaming. Um, we got like 15 minutes until kickoff. Now, while we wait on that, let's um, let's go over some college football scores right now. You know, um, today we got right now we got um we got Stanford. They're beating Northwestern 10 to 7 right now. Hold on, this is old. Hold on, let me update. Let me update this scoreboard. Let me update this. Shout out to everybody out there. What's going on, Cool Set? What's going on, Off the Grill? Shout out to everybody, man, that love college football, man. Um, I'll tell y'all right now, um, this time of year, college football is in. You're not going to hear me talking about much more than college football, you know? College football is way more exciting than um, the NFL to me, to me, because um, these, these um, kids that play, they actually, um, to me, they care, you know? John, K John Cato say USC is horrible. Um, what was the um, score for USC um, game? I did not catch that score. Right now in the fourth quarter, we got Stanford leading Northwestern 10 to 7. We got a minute and 24 left in that game. Um, we got Syracuse over Liberty right now, 10 to 0. Alabama blew the brakes off of um, Duke, 42 to 3. Ohio State. Ohio State. Mayor, what's going on, man? Yeah, they, they this is what I'm talking about. Ohio State, they played. Florida Atlantic. Florida Atlantic, y'all. Washington. They played Eastern Washington. The score of that game was 47 to 14. Then we got um then we got Penn State. They blew the brakes off of Idaho. Um the score for that game was 79 to 7 for that game. Um then we got Iowa State. They ba they're barely um they barely beat they barely beat Northern Iowa, 29 to 26. Nebraska, they beat South Alabama, 35 to 21. Really? South Alabama? We got another good game coming up tonight, man. We got number three, Georgia. They'll be taking on Vanderbilt. That's actually going to be a pretty good game right there. That's actually going to be a pretty good game. But I think, I think, the game of the night is Oregon. This is the game of tonight. Then we got we got Georgia Southern. Georgia Southern, they'll be going up against LSU 730. Middle Tennessee, they'll be playing Michigan 730. Then we got Iowa versus Miami of Ohio. Nico, what's going on there? Then we got Louisiana Tech. They're going up against Texas at 8 o'clock. We got New Mexico State. They'll be taking on Washington State at um 10 o'clock game. Thursday night, man, we had um we seen the champs. The champs, they took on um the champs. You gotta know who the champs is, right? Um they took on Georgia Tech. They beat Georgia Tech 52 to 14. <clears throat> then we had Texas A&M. They played that night. They beat Texas State 41-7. to 7. 
Um, Utah beat BYU 30-12. USC blew out Florida A&M 62-0. Michigan State beat Michigan State beat um, Tulsa 28-7. Wisconsin beat South Florida 49-0, man. Florida couldn't even get a point on the board. You know what I mean? The Jim Material Effect Sports. Yeah, I got to check that out. Definitely got to check that out. Shout out to everybody that's on. Welcome to the live stream, man. Let me know who you got going for tonight. Pick a team. Pick a team. We got Oregon going against, going up against Auburn Tigers, man. And I'm just going to let you know right now, I'm going for the Oregon Ducks. That's who I'm going for. Let me know your pick. I want to hear your pick right now. Who you guys got? Let me know who you got. Throw it up on the screen. Everybody that's in here, man, let, um, put your team on the screen. Let me know what team you are. You like. Yeah, Tennessee, they lost. Tennessee lost to um to Georgia. Who they play? Georgia Southern or Georgia State? Tennessee lost to Georgia State at home, man. Can you believe that? Tennessee, man. What's going on over there? You know, I was watching the um North Carolina versus uh South Carolina. I stepped away. I didn't see the outcome of that game. Let me go ahead and double check because I know um Matt Brown, he came back coaching. <clears throat> Let me see if he got his first win. That'd be good if he get his first win, man. You know Matt Brown. Yeah, Matt Brown, man. Um, he got his um, he got a win. He beat um, they beat South Carolina Gamecocks, twenty four to twenty. So that's pretty good for him. We got a War Eagle in the in the house. Shout out to all the War Eagles out there, man. Marcus, what's going on, man? Tonight, I'm looking for something, Marcus. I'm trying to see if you guys got what it takes. To beat Alabama this year because I'm not really too impressed with Alabama, man. Um, the the reason why Alabama beat beat Duke like that, I'm gonna tell you why. Duke was hanging in the game today, right? The game was zero zero going into the second quarter. The thing that Alabama have over a bunch of these weaker schools that they're gonna be playing is depth. They just sub players in and out, and all game long they got players coming in and out. And if you're not deep like Alabama is, you just cannot keep up with that man. Oh, you a Bama fan? <laughs> oh, you a Bama fan? You a Bama fan? Nah, we not allowed to show the game. We um. We not allowed to show the game. We just we just only allowed to talk about it. Yeah, Clemson definitely got their calling card, man. You know? But I'm telling you, Bama got... <laughs> yo, one thing I said about Alabama, they got some good... Yo, they got some good receivers, yo. Like, straight up. Like, Alabama's not really a passing team, but, yo, they got some good receivers, man. I'm not even going to play to you. I'm gonna play with you. Um, Number four, I forgot his name. That boy right there, he can fly. Then we got number 17, Waddle. He's a pretty good receiver. All four of their receivers is project projected to go to the NFL. You know what I mean? John Cato say Clemson ain't falling off for the next seven years. You're right about that because um the thing about Clemson, man, um, when Dabo comes to Florida and he goes to a high school, he gets whatever players he wants, man, you know? He gets whatever player he wants. Anything Dabo want, Dabo get. Dabo get what he want, man. Y'all go ahead and thumbs up the live for me, man. Um, anybody that's in here that can share me out, go ahead and share me out. You know, we're going to be topping it up. Mr. Mel, what's going on, man? Everything good with you? We just in here about to watch this um college football game. You know, it's that time of year again. Um, We got Kara Price in the building. What's going on, Karen? You know, at that time of year again, um, college football is back, you know, and yo, I'm telling you, can't wait for the game tonight, cannot wait for the game tonight, you know.
Let me make sure the thumbs up the live. Let me go ahead and share out my live. I'll go ahead and share out my own live. Share out my own live. But John Cato, you're right about Clemson. They definitely is not falling off for now. I, I want to see what Georgia got, man. I want to see what Georgia got. Um, I felt last year Georgia could have um, Georgia Georgia could have did better than they did. And um, JJ, what's going on, man? Georgia could have did better than they did, but um, I want to see what Georgia got. I want to see what Georgia got. I know one thing, man. For everybody that's in the SEC, do not sleep on Florida Gators defense. They got a really good defense, man. A really good defense. So does um the Miami Hurricanes, but their offense is not that good, man. Their offense is not that good. You know? The offense is definitely not that good. Yeah, you're right. I'm definitely I'm definitely wanna see what he does tonight. Anybody that's wanna watch along with us, man, um the game is on channel ten. It's about to come on a little bit. I think we got like another ten minutes to go. For the kickoff, anybody um, want to watch along? The game's going to be on ABC. Alabama had a slow start today. Slow start. They they definitely had a slow start today. Yo, I word. <laughs> Let me see something real quick. Kickoff time site. Um, kickoff is. Kickoff is any minute now, man, to be honest with you. Kickoff is coming up in like. Kickoff is coming up in like. Two minutes. Wait, you say, what's my favorite college team? What's my favorite college team? That's a bit. This is the best college team right here. That's the best college football team right there, man. Tell you, we got a good team is there, man. Well, we got a good defense. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know about our offense, but we got a good defense. You know what I mean? What's your best? Um, what's your favorite college team? Yeah, you're right, man. Um, yeah, you're right. <laughs> you're right about that, man. When I was watching that game, I was kind of confused, man. I don't know if um Florida D line is that good, or is our offensive line that sorry? I was really confused on what I was watching. Ah, cool. Say we got a good quarterback, man. Our quarterback was getting killed, man. We need a quarterback. Our quarterback is good, man. Our quarterback is good, bro. The thing is, the thing is, um, he was getting killed. The, hey, let me tell you something, right? I put that on the coach. Who said I put that on the coach? Because if you see our quarterback was getting blown up like that, why have him keep dropping back? I, I didn't get it. I didn't get the play calling. But, you know, I got to give it up to Florida, man. Um. Cole McKee, what's going on? The game about to kick off any minute here. I got to give it up to, um, got to give it up to Florida defense, man. They're pretty good. They are pretty good, man. And let 
And anybody that just jump up in the building, man, if you want to watch the game, watch along the game. The game's going to be on ABC. And I, and I mean, you know what? Oh, Adam B. Gus took over the offense? I didn't know that, man. I definitely didn't know that, you know? I didn't know that. Yo. <laughs> you know what? This is my first um first game that um I watch along live and I realized that I worded it wrong, so I apologize. You know what I mean? This is not a um stream as if I was showing so you guys know that we're not allowed to show the game. That's like a big copyright. You know, it's just a watch along. You know, so my bad. You know, but you guys are free to watch along with me. It's on ABC. It's on ABC, man. Jason say who's winning the game? Oh, um, Oregon Ducks, man. Um, Right now, I got Oregon Ducks winning the game. Um... I got the Ducks winning the game. Thirty-eight. Seen a quarterback. He got a lot to prove. Thirty-eight to twenty-three. Ducks. Who you got, Jason? Who you got, Jason? Y'all go ahead and thumbs up the live for me, man. Um, we're still waiting on kickoff. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're right, Jason. Um, it's definitely gonna be a close game. Yo, I got one big surprise, man. I got a big surprise for the day. I forgot to tell you guys, man. Um, Florida State lost. <laughs> Florida State lost today to Boise State. <laughs> Florida State lost today to Boise. Hey, we got to adore the Bulldog fans up in the building, man. You guys are going up against. You guys are going. <laughs> hey, you guys are going up against nobody tonight. Vanderbilt. I know you guys are gonna break, blow the brakes off of Vanderbilt, man. See, let me tell you something. Let me tell you guys something, right? Straight up. When it comes to Oregon Ducks, not Oregon Ducks. When it comes to um Auburn Tigers. LSU and the Miami Hurricanes, they take on anybody, anywhere, anytime. That's what I respect about those teams. They don't back down from nothing. They don't I respect these programs, man. They they they're willing to um play their tough schedule and they don't complain. Alabama got a weak schedule. Right now they got a, they just kicked off the ball. Oregon's gonna get the ball first. They're running it back right now. They just brought out the ball to the 26-yard line, man. Let's see what the senior quarterback got to say, man. Remember, um, this game is on channel on ABC, y'all. Uh, ABC. Y'all go ahead and thumbs up the live for me. Yeah, yeah. Alabama plays nobody, yo. <laughs> Nobody. Let's see what Oregon got. First and ten. Are you serious? First and ten. 
um, Oregon just got the ball, and um, they already took a timeout. First play of the game, they took a timeout. It's not looking good for the Oregon Ducks. Are you, are you serious? Are you gonna burn up a timeout and that, and the game just started? Are you really gonna burn up a timeout? Or you say put a mirror behind me? That's a good idea. Hey, that's a good idea. That's a good idea. Yeah, I never heard of a timeout in the first play, man. You got to get these boys ready to play. And we got red. Um, first play of the game. Um, Oregon Ducks picked up nine yards. One thing I can say about um Auburn um they got a good defense, man. They definitely got a good defense. You know what? That's a good idea, um, Brian. I'm gonna um see if somebody can bring me that. Well, technically, that is um legal, you know. Yeah, I'm drinking water right now. Oh, bleak. The game is on um, ABC. Bleak, the game is on ABC right now. Yeah, yeah, um, Brian, I'm definitely going to work on that because every Saturday I'm going to be um, streaming. I'm going to be um, coming on with college football. And that's a good idea, man. I appreciate you for giving me that idea. I'm definitely going to have that fully set up. That's a good idea, man. Brilliant idea, man. Right now, we got 32. Let's see what they do. Got first down, man. They handed off to Verdell. He picked up about four yards for the first down. Bleak, you a South Carolina fan? We got first and 10 at the 50 yard line. You a South Carolina fan? Man, y'all got beat by Matt Brown in the um, Tar Heels. Yeah, you're right. Y'all season is over. <laughs> I think we play the, um, I think the Miami Hurricanes, um, we play, we play North Carolina next week. That should be a um, very good game right there, you know. I can show you guys one play. Man, one play ain't gonna hurt none. Games on ABC. Anybody wanna um uh, but right now um Oregon Ducks is moving the ball. Um do I still got um is Jason still up in here? I told you, I told you the ducks is gonna um the ducks are gonna shot the world, man. The ducks gonna put it on armor, I'm telling you. You'll see. Right now we got first and and goal at the three yard line. Let's see what play they run. 
They hand the ball off. Verdell ran for two yards. Now it's going to be second and goal. Yeah, they're going to win the game, man. They're going to wear that defense down big time. Because one thing about the um, one thing about the Auburn Tigers, they got some big defenders. They got big defenders, but they get tired quick. Second and goal. Got tagged in the backfield, y'all. The problem with the um, Oregon Ducks right now, they're trying to run the ball in the middle, man. You cannot run up. You can't. You cannot pound the ball against the Tigers. That's that's not. If that's the way you're trying to win this game, it's not going to happen. Or you think the moment going to be too big for both? Now they now they have to throw third and goal. Let's see what he do. Yo, he's touchdown. Just got on the board. Quarterback put it in, man. Ducks get on the board first, six to zero. Quarterback rolled out to the right. Quarterback rolled out to the right. Fake the throw. Got in the end zone, man. Yeah, yeah, Jake Oregon will definitely win. They're going to win, man. I mean, it's not an upset if Oregon win. They are the number 11 ranked team in the nation. And um, Oregon is the number 11 ranked team in the um, nation. And um, Auburn is number 16 right now. Doing a replay, yo. He didn't score, yo. Yo, yo. They did a replay. I don't think he got the ball in. I don't think he got the ball in, but we'll see. Jason, you right about that. <laughs> you definitely right about that, man. No, you are right about that. Lamont Owens in the house. What's going on with you, man? Right now we got um we got a timeout. Um Oregon just put a touchdown on the board, but right now it's in review. Right now it is in review. Hey, this time is the best time of the year, man. College football. I love college football, man. I don't want to hear nothing about no trucks. I don't want to hear nothing about no trucks. I don't want to hear nothing about nothing right now. Saturday is May for college football. So all the fellas that's up in here on Saturday, kick the wife and kids out of the house, tell them to get out. It's time for you to watch some good old college football, man. Oh, Jay, me too. Me too. I actually um picked Oregon by about two touchdowns. But right now, the review, they took away the touchdown. So... It's fourth and goal. Let's see what Oregon do. Let's see. Um, oh, Cole McKee, you play college football for a D3 school? Yeah, man. Saturday is for college football, man. You guys go ahead and kick the wife and kids out the house. Tell them, hey, we're going to get some, throw some meat on the grill. We're going to sit back all day and watch college football all day, man. Hey, I like that. I like that. I like that. What just happened is, um, oh, y'all first game is on Saturday. What just happened is, um, Oregon went for it on the fourth down, and they put it, they put it back in the end zone, man. So <clears throat> they're winning right now.
Cole McKee, who you got? Who you play for, man? What position you play? And um, who you guys playing next week? Shout out to all the D3 college football players, man. Y'all keep doing y'all thing, man. Uh, make sure y'all get that education and just keep working at it, man. You just never know, man. You know, even though you play for a D3, there's always a possibility, man. They found it's a bunch of great players that came out of D3 that made it to the NFL. So just because you're in D3, D2, it don't matter, man. You know, all you got to do is believe. You know? Oh, you play strong safety? <laughs> hey, we got a War Eagle fan up in the building, man. Hey, War Eagle fans are so demanding, man. I'm telling you, y'all, you War Eagles are so demanding. I'm telling you. Oh, you guys play Worcester in Ohio? Oh, Dana, you watching that? Oh, you watching that home, Dana? Oh, more eagle. You got what you guys need to do is concentrate on Alabama in the Iron Bowl. That's what you guys need to do. Try to figure out how you're gonna stop them ten running backs that that Alabama got coming at y'all, and a hundred and a hundred um a hundred receivers, and, and and all these big old D linemen. And these linebackers, that's what you that's what you war eagles need to concentrate about. You gotta need to try to figure out how you're gonna win this game tonight. <laughs> but I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Zach, say let's go ducks. Yeah, I think the ducks gonna do it tonight, man. They definitely gonna do it. Shout out to everybody at home watching the game right now, man. Um, shout out to all that. Everybody in Alabama, man. Oh, you're sweating? Yeah, because I watched Alabama play today, and it's like Alabama just keep reloading, man. The thing I noticed about Alabama today is that I got one word to say about Alabama, right, today. Y'all, please thumbs up the live for me. I got 20, 27 people up in here. Thumbs up the live for me. Alabama, weight room. Weight room, weight room, weight room. Yo, them boys right there, they live in the weight room. They want so, they want, today they want so much one-on-one -on -one battles today. The running backs won so much one-on-one -on -one battles they did not fall behind they kept moving forward wait room. any kids that's out there listening um cole you up in here you play college football for d3 when you in that weight room bro go hard man go hard that weight room is so important that one-on-one -on -one, that extra yard is so important man i seen alabama the difference between Alabama and every other school out there, I'll give it to Clemson too. Them boys, they live in the weight room. It is the preparation, man. Them boys are bigger, stronger, faster, and nine out of 10 times, bigger, stronger, faster. Ends up with me. Let's see what Bo Nix got. Bo Nix got the ball first, and let's see what he got. That's a nice player, and a run. Yeah, them ducks are fast. Them ducks are always fast. We got to, um,
We got second down, man. Um, we got a um, Auburn lineman, number seventy-six. I can't even pronounce his name. He went off sides. Now they backed him up five yards. Hey, we got some trickery going on in the game, right? Yeah, you're right. Alabama is definitely hard to beat. <clears throat> Zach, I know, I know more people are doing, but I don't want to get a strike on my channel, you know? I definitely want don't want to get a strike on my channel. That's a big strike right there. Third and eight, Bo Nix threw away the ball. Yeah, them YouTube police are quick. I'm telling you, Brian, they probably, they're watching right now. You know, but hey, Auburn first time on the field and they turned the ball over. Oh, Zach, Jamaica, I'm from Jamaica. Dana, Dana Nixon got a, um, yeah, he's fast. <laughs> Arbor's putting it on them right now. Dana Nixon said, hey, I'm about to check out when y'all get on Facebook. Do me a favor, check out my granddaughter. Type in Paisley Strong. She's our little miracle. One open heart surgery done. She's my heartbeat. Uh, y'all definitely check her out. I'll keep her in my prayers. Dana, y'all make sure to check her out. You know? And make sure you have a great day. Make sure you have a great day. And kiss your little granddaughter. <laughs> But um, anybody want to jump on the Miami Hurricanes um bandwagon? Anybody want to jump on the Miami Hurricanes bandwagon? You are free to jump on right now, you know. But I'm telling you, this year we're gonna bring us. We're gonna do big things this year, you know. We're gonna do big things this year. Oh, Zach, I, I think Oregon going to win. I picked Oregon at the beginning of the game. I forgot um what score. I picked I pick, um, Oregon by two touchdowns. I pick, um I picked the Ducks by two touchdowns. Let me check in on Georgia, see what Georgia got going on. You know, right now, Georgia is playing a, playing a whole bunch of nobody right now. Bulldogs. Let's see what they, they're doing over there. Right now, we got Georgia Bulldogs. They're up 7-0 on the Vanderbilt. They're up 7-0. Brian right? You are so right about that. Um, Canes have the best talent, man. Yo, you see Canes players go in the NFL, and you're like, really? You really play for Miami? But, like, when they're in college, they just they just can't get it back together, man. It's been, like, it been like 2001 since we last won a championship. That's, like, 18 years ago. It's been a really long time, man. 
it, 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 it's been really a long time, man. It's time for us to get it back together. And ter we're terrible right now. It's been a long time, man. Long time. I'm going to tell you guys after this play. So we got a first down for the Oregon Ducks inside Auburn 30 yard line, man. Oregon is definitely put it on Oregon right now. They had the 30 yard line, first and 10. The Auburn um, defense looking like they're getting tired. Their offense is doing them no justice right now. Yeah, definitely a lot of Hall of Famers came out of um, Miami Hurricane School. It's definitely, man, it's crazy how, um, when you talk about safety, talk about Ed Reed, Sean Taylor, um, linebackers. Think of all the linebackers we put in. Think of all the um, running backs, McGahee, Porter, all the running backs we put out there, man. It, it, quarterback, Jim Kelly. <laughs> Jim Kelly to me might be the, a lot of people don't remember that Jim Kelly went to the um the Hurricanes and Jim Kelly man he had that famous four year run four years in a row he went to the Super Bowl sorry he had to lose all four but at least he went though. Oh Zach, you going home to watch the game? Man, or hey, right now Oregon is moving the ball. We got right now we got first and ten at Auburn's eighteen yard line. Man. Oh, I, I, I didn't know that. Um, yeah, yeah, Chip Kelly do coach them. Right now, it's first it's first and um, goal. First and goal at Auburn three-yard line. Oh, Tavia, I just got a um, message from YouTube say they'll strike my channel if I um, show the game. So I apologize for that. So we got second and goal at Auburn's four yard line. Third and goal for the Oregon Ducks. Oh, top of you, you can't get it up on anything? Yeah, man, I apologize, man. It's, these people are very strict, man, very strict. They'll demonetize my channel. They'll strike my channel. They'll take my channel down, man. Yeah, Oregon is driving down the field. There, it's um third and goal from like the second yard line right now. Auburn just took a timeout. They took a smart timeout because the defense is very tired right now. Yeah, that's it, Brian. That's why. I, that's why I thought they were gonna lose the game because exactly what I was saying. Um, Oregon gonna run them out of gas. You know, I don't think um. Auburn have what it takes to keep up with the pace of um you guys right here. Okay, I have to say something. I appreciate y'all for joining me, man. We're gonna be doing this every Saturday. We 
we're going to be doing this every Saturday, you know. Um, talk about your team. Talk about your team. You talk crap about your team, whatever. You know what I mean? Um, football day, man, you know. <clears throat> Nigel, they just warned me. They just warned me that they're going to give me a strike if um if I show the game. So I had to stop showing it. So I didn't want them striking my channel. So I apologize for that. They just warned me, say, if I just got an email, if I show the game. They're quick, man. These people work fast. You know? These people work fast. But the game is on ABC, people. The game is on ABC. Yeah, we got a timeout right now. We got a commercial timeout right now. Zach, I'm going to keep you updated. We got a commercial timeout right now. Auburn, um, Auburn actually took a timeout. Them boys are exhausted. They are definitely exhausted right now. And for anybody that's just joining, um, coming up in here, um, basically what my YouTube channel is about is about trucking. That's what I do. I'm a truck driver. Oh, Nigel, I'm going for the um Oregon Ducks. I'm a truck driver. I usually do um trucking um videos and trucking lives, but I'm telling you, I'm telling you, this is college football season. I don't want to hear nothing about no damn trucks. You get in a damn truck and drive the thing, okay? That's my advice. What's the best company? The company you damn work for. That's the best company. You know? Get in the truck and drive. I don't want to hear shit about no truck. Talk to me after college football season. But that's what I do, y'all. I'm a truck driver. Um, I run a trucking channel. But I don't want to hear about nothing about no truck. Packers Nation, yeah, Oregon is definitely going to run around the way to this one. Packers Nation, you got a YouTube channel? Oh, man, that quarterback blew it, man. What kind of pass is that, bro? Yeah, I see. Yeah, Packers Nation. I seen what y'all did to, um, I seen what y'all did to, um, it was a shame what y'all did to um, South Florida, man. How y'all come to? How y'all did that to a Florida team like that? I felt that. And they missed the Oregon just missed the field goal. Oh, Mississippi State struggle against the um Louisiana. What do I think about the um, USC and Fresno game today? I mean, I didn't really pay attention to that game, but I heard um, USC. I heard USC sucked in that game. I heard USC sucked in that game. So, Wisconsin, so Packer Nation, man, you like Wisconsin, right? If you join my live earlier, we were talking about. I don't understand these college football teams that's playing these easy schedules, man. They don't want to put nobody on their schedule. Yo, we just got a big play from um Arvin Tigers. Bo Nix just threw. Bo Nix just threw like a thirty yards complete pass to a receiver. Right now, the ball is at the. Oregon 42 yard line. Bo Nix got the ball. Bo Nix is running. Picked up the first down.
Yeah, Clemson definitely looking good. De Clemson is. Auburn is going fast. First and 10. And off inside to the running back. He picked up about three yards. Oh, you guys have seven games against the top 25 team? That's actually pretty good. Not bad at all. That's actually pretty good, man. Hey, Jake, I'm going to get to your comment in a second. Bobo Nix overthrew Nixon in the end zone. Hey, I'm gonna get to you. I'm gonna get to. I'm gonna get to that comment in a second. As a matter of fact, let me highlight this comment. Let me highlight this comment. I want. I want everybody to answer that question right there, cause that's the same thing I was saying, yo. Alabama got an easy schedule, yo. Like, who are they playing? Like Alabama, like they be playing Alabama middle school. Like, come on now, put some teams on your schedule. Or pack of nation like NFL more. <clears throat> and to answer your question, Jake, that's the same thing I was wondering, yo. I don't understand Alabama's schedule. I just don't get it. I do not get it. So right now, Arvin, um, just put three on the board. So right now it's seven to three in the first quarter. We got three seventeen to go in the game. Y'all do me a favor. Y'all do me a favor. Y'all thumbs up the live for me. Thumbs up the live for me. Please thumbs up the live for me, man. And y'all remember, man, um, every Saturday we're going to be talking crap. We're going to be talking junk. We're going to be talking shit about college football, man. So y'all come in here. Y'all come in here every Saturday. Feel free to get drunk and talk that crap. Talk that mess. <laughs> Brian. Hey, this vision said they pull a Clemson and schedule easy. Hey, Zach, you could. I mean, you could. You just got to know how to reword it. You understand me? Because they like to, they like to, yo, you two be tripping, man. They like to give, they like to strike people channel and stuff like that, you know? But any little thing, man, you just, you know? Oh, you know what? Now, let me let me check out Alabama's schedule this year, Jake. Let me look at Alabama's schedule. You know what? I seen Alabama's schedule. They gotta play LSU. They got LSU and they got they played two teams this year. LSU and um they gotta play LSU and one other team that's tough. Let me try to remember, man. LSU and um Yo, I'm telling you right now, Verdell just took the ball and he ran down the field for about 20 yards. Yeah, LSU, Texas A&M. And you, yeah, Alabama played LSU and Texas A&M. You can take out that South Carolina. They're going to blow the brakes off of South Carolina. You can take that out. You can take out that South Carolina. They're going to beat the mess out of South Carolina. 
Y'all yeah, thumbs up the live for me. Thumbs up the live. So right now we just got Verdell. He picked up a bunny yards. Uh, and, and they're going to tack on an extra 15 because Auburn just um, got a face mask penalty against them. I'm telling you one thing, folks. Auburn is fast. They are fast. Oh, yeah, Jake, you're right. That iron ball. Yeah, you're right. Oh, the Beavers lost to Oklahoma? <laughs> Crest Boy say, who does Clemson play? No one in top 25. Let me check out Clemson's schedule before I judge Clemson. I'm going to look at Clemson's schedule. So right now we got... um. Oh, we just got Auburn. We just got Oregon through a touchdown. Now the game is... um. They're up 13-3 right now in the first quarter 211 to go in the first quarter what a play y'all what a play let me look at up yeah dana i know you're mad that was a nice play though oregon is fast oregon is fast we got longhorn fan in the house agent what's going on man everything good with you Appreciate you for coming through, man. You guys make sure to hit that like for me. Make sure to hit that like button for me. <laughs> this is to say Clemson. <laughs> Clemson is in a basketball, a boss, a basketball um conference. Okay, let me check out Clemson on um, schedule. Okay, so Clemson. Okay, next week they got Texas A&M. They're number 12. They got Syracuse. They're number 22. Then they got Charlotte. That's a win. They got UNC. That's a win. Then they got poor Florida State. They're going to beat the crap out of Florida State. Florida State just lost to Boise State today in Florida State. The game was supposed to be played on a neutral field, but because of the hurricane, they moved it to Doe Campbell Stadium. They still lost. Then they got Louisville. That's a win. Then they got Boston College. That's a win. Then they got Wolford. Who the hell is Wolford? W-O-F-F-O-R-D. Really, Clemson? Anybody ever heard of this college? Wolford. W-O-F-F-O-R-D. Wolford. Clemson. Really? Then they have NC State. Then they have Wake Forest. Then they have South Carolina. This vision, I got to agree with you, man. This vision, I got to agree with you. Clemson have a soft-ass schedule. Oh, Wolford is a D3 college? I got to look them up, man. That's... Wolford Terriers football. Check it out, y'all. Wolford is a terrier. <laughs> Wolford is a terrier. Like, who's scared of a terrier? They're first in the Southern. Right now, they're losing to South Carolina State, 6-21. to they're, they're located in South Carolina, so... They've been around since 1889. I just never heard of them. Wolford, 
Very interesting. Right now we got, right now I just went and looked how many Warford players are in the NFL. We actually got two Warford players in the NFL right now. We got Brenton Burson and Casey Redfern. And before that, that's very interesting. We got an LSU Tigers up in the building, man. What's going on with the Tigers, man? How y'all looking today? How are you guys looking today? You guys are playing Georgia Southern, man. But you know what? You got to play who's on your schedule, right? So you're doing what you got to do. You doing what you got to do. LSU is beating the brakes out of Georgia Southern. They're up twenty-eight to zero. So LSU doesn't play. Let me tell you something. Um, let me tell you something, Zeus. One thing I respect about the Tigers, they play anybody, anywhere, anytime. I respect a team like that. It's not like Northern Dame that. If you want to play Northern Dame, you got to go see them or. You got to play on a neutral field or if you're good this year, they don't want to play you or LSU, Miami Hurricanes, even Auburn. They play anybody, anytime, anywhere. Zach said, is there more team in in, in NFL or, or college. Oh, Zeus, you have a feeling on um, LSU will do good this year? Zach, want to know if there's more team in NFL or college. They might be more college teams in two states than it is in the NFL. There's a lot of damn college football team, man. You even got some college football team that you never heard of. You got some college football teams that whenever their games is going on, Texas high school football team is bigger than them. Oh, you're in the Philippines, Arm Zeus? You live in the Philippines or are you just visiting the Philippines right now? You live in the Philippines or you just visiting? I appreciate everybody stopping by, man, right now. Oh, you lived there for eight years? Okay, that's what's up, man. Hope you're doing good down there. Hope everybody down there doing good, man. Hope the weather is treating you guys fine. You know? Yeah, LSU. LSU is doing good. Let me check in on that Georgia Bulldogs. Let me check in on that Georgia Bulldogs um, score right now. Okay, the Bulldogs are still up 7-0. Oh, they scored again? Oh, 14-0? Okay. The Bulldogs have beaten Vanderbilt 14-0. Bobby Wells or anybody that's up in here, man. Do you guys know um where is Vanderbilt from again? Is it is it a Tennessee? Are they from Tennessee or Georgia? I forgot. I think they're from Tennessee. Yeah, yeah, this game right here is the, is the only top 25 matchup. 
They're from Tennessee. Okay, yeah, that's what I figured. <clears throat> Vanderbilt is not a walkover, though, man. Vanderbilt is um is a is a respectable team. Let's just say respectable. You know, they show up to play. Hey, right now, the drink of the day is some good old Jack. So, in the fourth, in the third quarter, I might not sound the same, y'all. So, if y'all home right now, y'all make sure to grab some good old Jack or something that's close to it. All right, um, Zeus, man, appreciate you for stopping in, man. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Everybody that's up in here, man, y'all make sure to um subscribe to my channel. You know what I mean? I talk a lot about trucking. I run a trucking channel. All the girls say you like that Crown Royal. I run a trucking channel, but um, it's college football season, so I'm going to be talking about college football. Oh, Vanderbilt is that type of school? Oh, okay. Hey, this vision, that's what makes Miami um such a um hard to rebuild because it is it, this kind of and they used to be able to get kids in Miami easy. But um they got kind of strict and you know Miami is like a smart college. Oh, Crest Boy got some Jack and Coke right now. <laughs> Hey, y'all make sure to subscribe to my channel, man. Brian got some Gorilla Glue. That's what I'm talking about, man. College football Saturday, man, where all the fellas pour, pour up your favorite drink. Right now, we got first and 10 at Oregon 40-yard line. We got Auburn driving the ball right now. Go Knicks. Wide open, man. Bo Nix hit number 22 for a big game, man. Right now, it's first and 10 at Oregon 12-yard line. Oh, Bobby Wells, um, Boy Brothers. Um, I haven't heard anything negative about Boy Brothers, but... I I haven't heard I can't say I, I haven't heard anything about him, but I could tell you um uh, one thing, Bobby was if you can get in if you can get with Creek Carriers, if you can get with that company called Creek Carriers, that's a good company to drive for, man. That's a really good company to drive for. So if they're hiring in your area, definitely check them out. That's a really good company right there. They'll take care of you. You know they pay some of the Hot pay in the um, truck driving industry right now. Jake, you're right about that. Let me highlight that message. Let me highlight this. Let me highlight this right here. O M G O. Oregon Ducks. Auburn drew. Auburn drove the ball down to Oregon Ducks 12 yard line and Bo Nix. They threw an interception. Oregon got the ball back. But, Jake, you are so right, man. You are right, bro. I said the same thing this year. How can you let Boise State, they move the game from a, from a neutral field, they put it in your stadium because of the hurricane, and you got beat? By Boise State at home, Willie Taggart. No excuse. None. You do Florida State do not lose to Boise State. It's just a no no. You don't lose to Boise State. It doesn't matter if Florida State is ranked or not ranked. This is Florida State. We get they get good players. I'm sorry, Willie. I'm sorry, but I mean, I know I'm a Hurricane fan, but I feel it for the Florida State fans. Like, 
It's time. You know, don't even waste time. Don't even waste time with him. Just get him out of there. Get him out of there. Oh, are the Broncos doing good this year? NFL ain't started yet. <laughs> yeah, Chris Boy, they gotta, they gotta um you do not lose to Boise at home. You just do not. FSU do not lose to Boise at home. I don't care if FSU is ranked or not. Oh, you say Tennessee? Yeah, you're right. This vision, that was embarrassing. <laughs> this vision, you're absolutely right. That was embarrassing today. Like, if I was the AD, I would have came and fired a coach on the spot. Tennessee do not lose to... Who they played again? The Georgia something? You do not lose to Georgia something the first game at home. You do not do that, man. Yo, where are these coaches coming from? And and, and, and don't let's not just put it on the coaches. Let's put it on the players. Now you gotta recognize the tradition and the schools that you play for. Florida State, Charlie Ward, Ward Dunn. You serious? Yo, I think I'm gonna start picking against some of these teams, yo. When, hey, whenever I see some of these teams like a 15, 20 point underdog, I'm gonna go ahead and lay the cash out. I'm gonna make some money off some of these teams, man. I'm going to make some money off some of these teams. You watch and see. Right now, we got first and 10 for the Oregon Ducks at the 12-yard line after the interception. And that was a very dumb play. Um, I don't like that play. They just threw a screen pass on first and 10. You got the plug on what? Oh, y'all make sure um everybody that's up in here, join me on Thursdays. I do my cooking show on Thursdays. Colorado play Colorado State. Oh, okay. All right, I'll check you out. I'll check you out. Colorado play. Colorado State and the Buffalo won. I think those two teams always. Yeah, hey, whoever that smart person was, whoever that was that laid that cash out on um Georgia State, yo, they made some money today. <laughs> they made some serious money today. They definitely made some serious money today. Y'all make sure to go ahead and um, subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell. Right now we got the um we got Oregon Ducks. Keep trying to run up in the middle. I just don't get it. They keep trying to run up in the middle on the Auburn Tigers. Like, you just don't do that. Now we got third and three. Yeah, the Ducks are looking pretty good. We got third and three at the um, Ducks 33-yard line. 10 minutes and 28 seconds left to go in the second quarter. That's a very dumb play right there, but hey, they got a punt. 
They got a punt. They just don't surprise me. They just don't want Arbor and thinking they are scared to go up in the middle. Got to front a little bit. Yeah, I get it. Yeah, you're right about that. Keep the um, keep the linebackers honest. Oh, Zach. Oh, Ahmad. All my mods have a, um, have a blue tool. You know, and basically mods are, um, people that make sure y'all subscribe to everybody that all my mods I only got one mod up in here so far but y'all subscribe to all my mods pull up oh flag down Joshua Taylor what's going on man everything good with you Big props to the, the bad walk on the kicker with he's a walk on kicker with 56 yard game winner. I gotta look that up. See a walk on kicker. Y'all make sure to hit that thumbs up for me. Hit, please hit that thumbs up for me. Please hit that thumbs up for me. Next, next week, I'm going to have this thing set up right. Next week, I'm going to have this thing set up right. I'm going to have a mirror behind me. I'm going to have a mirror behind me. So guess what? They can't stop me from having a mirror behind me, right? So if y'all happen to see the game in the mirror, I mean... Shout out to Brian for that idea. Brilliant idea. Brilliant idea. I'm definitely gonna have a mirror behind me. <clears throat> you know? Shout out to Brian. Everybody in here, make sure to check out all the YouTubers channels on here, man. Feel free to network. If you're a YouTuber, feel free to network. You know, that's what we do. If you're a YouTuber on here, feel free to network with each other. I mean, network, talk about the game. I mean, that's what my channel is all about, man. We talk about sports, talk about life, talk about work. Just positivity, man. Just positivity. You know, we don't talk about negative. Every Thursday, I'm going to have on. Um, every Thursday, I do live cooking. So if there's anything you guys want to learn how to cook or know how to cook, just, just drop me a message, an email, anything. And um, if I don't know how to cook it, I'll, I'll figure it out. If I don't know how to do it, I'll definitely figure it out. Shout out to everybody that's coming in and out. Shout out to everybody that's coming in and out. I haven't seen none of my truck drivers so far. I haven't seen none of my truck drivers' friends up in the building so far, man. Oh, that's right. Joe Harrington did play for the Oregon Ducks. And we had Marcus Mariota. Make a video of me trying that Popeye chicken. Y'all making me money. Yeah, you're right. That, that'd be good right there. Yeah, you're right about that. I need to look into that. Good idea, man. Good 
good idea, bro. Right now, we got Auburn Tigers moving the ball. They got second and six. We just had Oregon Ducks. We got Auburn with a free play. Um, Oregon just jump off sides. Shout out everybody that's jumping up in here, man. If you're just coming up in here. Yeah, Brian, I thought the same. I thought that the Michael James was going to light up the NFL for real, man. He did nothing. That's one of the fastest guys I ever seen in my life. When that guy touched the ball, it's like, it's like, it was, it's like, it was magic. I'm like, damn, he's fast. The Michael James work at a burger place? Nah, I don't want to believe that, man. Let me look this up. Are you being serious, Jack? Hey, I got bad news for y'all. Somebody got to get me posted on the game. I got bad news. I got direct TV and it's raining. I got direct TV and it's raining. You said, Michael, you said, hold up. He owned the burger place, man. He owned the burger place, man. I knew it wasn't going to be that bad. It's on, he owned the burger place. It's called Killer Burger. <laughs> he owns it, man. You know, so I guess it's not that bad if he owns it. Hey, I got bad news, guys. Somebody got to keep me updated on the game now because I got Sucky Direct TV. It's raining outside. My service is gone. I guess I can keep looking at the internet, see what's going on. I'll give you guys the, um all the scores and updates. While I wait for Direct TV to get their act together. So right now we got Syracuse. They're playing nobody. They're up 24 to 0 in the fourth quarter with 10 minutes and 30 seconds to go. Then we have Iowa. They're losing to Ohio, Miami. Then we got Michigan. That's another coach that um that's another coach that got to go. They're up 17-10 on Middle Tennessee. That's a coach that got to go. I, I don't I, Enough of that coach. Enough of that coach right there. Enough. Edward Lee said third down. Armour got the ball. What's going on, Edward Lee? I appreciate you for telling me what's going on, man. I got this stupid, crappy-ass DirecTV, and right now it's raining, and I cannot see nothing on the game. So you say Arvin got the ball third down. You from Alabama. Shout out to everybody from Alabama, man. Appreciate y'all for joining my channel. Make sure y'all subscribe to my channel, man, because I talk about other things, man. I'm a truck driver. I talk a lot about trucking. Anybody out there that's ever interested in driving a truck, man, just join my channel, man. We talk to a lot of truck drivers. That's all we do all day, all long. You know what I mean? And um, I also cook. I like to cook. And every Thursday I run, um, I cook live. I cook live every Thursday. So y'all make sure to hit that subscribe button. 
if y'all want to see me in action. This vision, that's a good question. I think I got to go with Willie Taggart. I got to go with Willie. You made this prediction. I guarantee you that one of those guys is going to get fired. The boosters is going to get the money up. They're going to be like, you know what? Just take this money and get the hell out of here. We're good. Take the money and get out. We'll find us another coach. You know? Edward Lee, man, how you feel about the Iron Bowl this year? Who you going for in the Iron Bowl? How you feel about the Iron Bowl this year? Jake said, got to be Willie. Yeah, it got to be Willie, man. It got to be Willie. Florida State, do not lose a boy who stayed at home. I'm like, oh, Edward Lee say he got a friend who is on. Um, a trucker, he is Jamaican. Okay, okay. Oh, Jake said just because um FSU was up for the majority of the game. You got 15 people, 16 people in the house right now. Right now, we watching Auburn versus the Oregon Ducks. Right now, we got Oregon Ducks up 14 to 3. On the Auburn Tigers, we got fourth and seven. We gonna have Auburn putting the ball back to Oregon. Edward Lee say if oh my God, people, Oregon. Oregon just took the ball from a punt. They just took it like 70 yards. The Ducks are inside the 10. My TV is back up. I appreciate everybody for filling me up, filling me in. My TV is back in. One thing I can say about um, Oregon Ducks, they are fast. Oregon Ducks is fast. First and goal at the Auburn nine-yard line. Let's see what Oregon going to do right now. Hands off. They fumble the ball. They fumble the ball. Auburn picked up the ball, number one. Let's see what type of speed he got. He's taking it back all the way. Could he go all the way? 20, 10, 5, down at the two-yard line. Unbelievable. Unbelievable change of event, guys. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Now we got we got Arbor set up pretty good at the I think they're at the two yard line. Yeah, that was a pretty good play right there. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Let's see what they do with it. I'm going to say this right now. I'm going to say this right now. I do not like Auburn's offense. I do not like their play calling. Who's calling the play for Auburn? Their play calling sucks. 
Their OC needs to get fired right now. What is he doing? All right, now we got second and goal from the four-yard line. They fumble the ball. Unbelievable, people. Unbelievable, man. Oh, Gus is calling the plays. Unbelievable what's going on right now. Unbelievable. Now we got third and goal. Now we are at the um, seven yard line. Let's see what let's see what Arvin does. Third and goal from the seven. Bo Nix, hike the ball. Roll out. Confused. Run around. Still running around. In Oregon defense. Make a stand. The Ducks defense make a big stand. That was pretty embarrassing for the Oregon Ducks. Auburn Tigers, man. I, pretty embarrassing. You got the ball to the two yard line only to try to kick a field goal. That's embarrassing, man. Now we got to score 14 to 6. Oh no, that wasn't a touchdown. He didn't run it back all the way. He just got to the two yard line. He didn't, when he got that fumble, he did not run the ball back all the way. Edward Lee say Gus need to be in a Pac-10. No, Gus need to be in high school. <laughs> Those are high school plays right there. As a matter of fact, I'm sorry, those are not high school plays. Because high school teams are running like real offenses right now. Those like really? With those play calls? Yo, you're at the two yard line. Like, who are you tricking? Put a big boy in the back. Give me double tight. Put a big boy in the in the back. Give me double tight. Put your put your put your running back. Let him follow your big boy. And run to the strong side. Really? I almost can't watch no more of this game. It's embarrassing these play calls. You really gonna do all the trickeries right there? I cannot believe it. Man. I cannot believe this. Appreciate everybody for stopping through, man. Make sure you guys go ahead. Uh, head. Oh, what was that mess? Hold up. What's going on? Yeah, Edward, that was messed up, man. They didn't um score that touchdown, man. That really messed up. Really messed up, bro. Shout out to all nine people, ten people up in the building right now. Appreciate y'all for stopping through. You know, every Saturday we're gonna be up in here talking junk about football, man. So y'all make sure. Y'all check us out for college football. You know, we're going to be doing this every Saturday. And let me get back to the scores and the highlights. Bo Nick don't know what he's doing. Jake <laughs> said, Bo Nick don't know what he's doing. <laughs> hey, Jay, you made the screen with your comments. Like, this is the fourth time you made the screen, man. <laughs> Good 
Lamar say, laugh out loud. You like Miami? Who's your team, Lamar? Who's your team, bro? Who's your team, bro? Lamar, who's your team, bro? Miami got legacy, man. Miami have legacy. Tell me your team. Tell me your team, Lamar. Tell me your team. The Ducks. I'm actually going for the Ducks tonight. I'm actually going for your team tonight. And what you do, you come in here and laugh after my team. You laugh at my team. You laugh at my team. When well, we got five national championships. How many of you guys have? <laughs> you say keep bow in. <laughs> keep bow in. So keep bow in. So ducks. <laughs> That's crazy. But well, shout out to all the Oregon Duck fans that's up in here right now. Sure. Hey, we love to talk about the '90s because that's our that's our legacy, man. We don't have nothing good to talk about for the last 18 years, so we gonna talk about the '90s, man. You know? You know? Hurricane for life. Yes, I played for Miami Hurricanes. Yep. I'm telling you, Miami Hurricanes had a have a lot of great players that came out of there that are still coming out of there until today. Oh, you competed with both, Jake? Oh, okay. That's what's up, man. We got Casey in the building. What's going on, Casey? All right, Lamar, I'm going to ask you one question, right? I'm going to ask you one question. You're an Oregon Duck fan. After this play, you're an Oregon Duck fan, right? Yeah, Casey, football season is definitely back in full effect. Okay, Lamar. Where's your where's your head coach from? Where's your head coach from? What school did your head coach go to? What school did your head coach go to? I just want to hear you say it. I think that, in my opinion, I 
I don't think you guys got the right coach right now. That's just my opinion, okay? And we got a Colorado fan up in the building, man. They beat the brakes. Well, y'all didn't beat the brakes off of them. Y'all just beat them 45 to 31. Thank you, Brian. I was waiting. I was waiting for Lamar to say it. He didn't even know. He didn't even know, man. He did not even know. Thank you. Keynes might not be good right now, but Keynes is everywhere. Everywhere you look, you see a Keynes. On Sunday, you 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 go to NFL Network, you see a Keynes and um. In, 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 in um in, in in Irvin, everywhere you go, you see a Miami Hurricane. You know what? I forgot. Um. Oh, you was you was um. He, he should have stayed. Well, what's wrong with his background? I never heard anything about um about Willie Taggart. Yeah, we got a pass in the fair and big call. A big call on the plate. We got an Oregon player down on the field right now. We got one. Oregon got some small football players, though. Oregon got some small, speedy football players. You know? Yeah, right now we got a player down, taking a look, walking off the field. These, these players are small, man. These, yo, these Oregon Ducks players are so small, yo. Fast. Yeah, yeah, Cristobal got a good, solid, solid, um, Background, you know. Throw the ball, Bo Nix. Auburn fans, let me ask y'all a question, right? Where the hell do y'all get this quarterback from, man? Where did y'all get this quarterback from? Right now we got a free play. It should be a free play. Lamar got a question for me. Why is Miami schedule so weak? I'm gonna be honest with you, like you want to hear the truth? We are down right now. We're hurting right now. We're down big time. We're not as we're not as good as we used to be. So that's why our schedule is so weak. And we play in the ACC. The ACC schedules are generally weak to me. The ACC is not really a good conference to me. Clemson is king of the ACC, even though they play a little puppy schedule. Also, they play a little cupcake. I think. 
Clemson play. Interception. Bo Nix do an interception. Second interception of the game. Right now, Oregon got the ball back. Timothy Madden up in the building say, Miami is trash, bro. What's your team, Timothy? What's your team, bro? Nah, I took the hat off because I got I was I got hot, man. That's why I took the hat off. I took the hot hat off because I got hot hot. And this what we this what this Saturday is gonna be about, man. Trash talk. As long as y'all don't bring no profanity, trash talk Saturdays, man. Come in here and represent your team. Talk as much trash as you want. You know, talk bad about my team. I'll talk crap about your team. So y'all make sure to tune in every Saturday and check it out, man. You know, y'all can crap on Miami. We know we suck. We suck, and I know it. <laughs> you know what I mean? But we're trying to come back. It is what it is, man. Um, a team can't stay on top forever. We had a we had a nice ride. The '90s was great for us, but the the the, the um recruiting competition in Florida right now is so tough, man. Yeah, I love this time of year, man. Nah, nah, it's all good. <laughs> I appreciate y'all for watching. Yeah, yeah, the early 2000, 2001. 2001, 2003, 2001, 2003, and um, in the 80s, in the late 80s, in the early 90s. But right now, the recruiting in Florida, we got to compete with the Gators. We got to compete with FSU. We got to compete with South Florida, even though they got the brakes. South Florida got the breaks. When I say compete, I'm not talking about um, I'm not talking about um, teams actually being good. I'm talking about the facility, the size of the college. But to me, the like when you talk about size of a college, the biggest college that I've seen with my own eyes is UCF. So we got all Miami's a private school, people. Miami is a little private school. So the things they did, the things they did when they did it was, yo, was great. You know what I mean? Like, let's just be honest. Yeah, he threw another pick. He's trash. He got to go. Auburn returning the punt. He's at the 50. Let's just be honest, guys. UCF have been running Florida for the past couple of years. And the Gators have always kept a pretty good defense, but UCF, that's University of Central Florida. They've been the uh, best Florida team for the past few years. Yeah, yeah, all all these teams are um coming to Florida and taking these kids away, man. And every time, every time Dabo come to Florida, he just get who he want. He just go to the best high school and be like, okay, I want him, 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 and him. Like Dabo, get who he want. Nick Saban, he don't even got to show up. He just make a couple phone calls. You know, hey, I want you to play for Alabama. You know? Oh, Lamar, you lived in Florida? You serious? How you became an Oregon fan, man? That's very interesting. Um, how you became an Oregon fan?
Well, shout out to everybody that's home right now, man. All the hardworking people. Make sure y'all grab y'all a drink today, man, and just enjoy. Oh, you're recruited by D3 School in Oregon? Okay, that's what's up. So that's how you became an um, Oregon Duck fan. That's what's up, man. What is like up there in Oregon, man? What is like um the weather, man, coming out of Florida? So you know us, we're down here in the tropical, man. Um, what is like up there, bro? What was the culture different, man? Like, what is like up there? How you adjusted to the snow, the, the coldness, the weather, the way people, you know? We got Knicks. He ran for the first down. We got 31 seconds left in the second quarter. Let's see what Bo Nix and the War Eagle does. Brian say he's from the Pacific Northwest and he loves Florida. <laughs> oh, people love the Ducks? Well, Nate's got sack with Lamar. Let me ask you a question. Um, what um you play? So you play football right now for um for that D three college? What position you play, man? What position do you play, Oregon and Clemson earn their place in the SEC? Edward, you think Clemson, Oregon don't look right in the um I don't think they'll put Oregon in the in the SEC just for geographical um reason. That'd be a hard travel. But Oregon gotta keep on Nah, that'd be hard. All the grill cook for UMD football, soccer, basketball team. They the University of Maryland. You cook for their football team. That's what's up. Oregon Ducks is playing, y'all. Oregon Ducks is definitely playing right now. Definitely playing. They came. They came to play today. You got 10 people up in the building, man. Y'all make sure to hit that like for me. Appreciate y'all. Y'all hit that like button for me, man. I appreciate it so much. I appreciate everybody for joining me so much, man. Yeah, that Oh, you say that because they're a balanced team? Yeah, they're a good team, but um, think about um, think about the um traveling that. Think about where Oregon is located in the um state, and think about um the traveling, like them traveling to Alabama to play Alabama, them traveling back to the south to play Vanderbilt, to play Florida, to play LSU, to play Maryland. To play all these teams in the SEC, that's just like 
it'll be tough on them. Most of the team that's in their conference is actually on their side of the state. But when you talk about Clemson, you're right about that. They need to go ahead and put Clemson in the SEC. You put Clemson in the SEC, like, <laughs> SEC is going to be crazy. SEC would be crazy. And I wouldn't want them in the same conference with Alabama. I want them on the other side. I am too. I am two away from 2,100 subscribers. If you guys did not subscribe to my channel, feel free to go ahead and hit the subscribe button right now. And that's the end of the first half. That's the end of the first half. Right now we are um, looking at a hurricane right now. Oh, you said if we lose against um Alabama Auburn, if y'all lose the Alabama Auburn game, Gus is gone. I think, yeah, you're right. Gus is definitely gone if y'all lose that game. Yeah, right now we on halftime right now, guys. We in halftime right now. <laughs> hey, this vision say Gus may not make it past the um Gus may not make it past <laughs> Gus may not make it past the game. And that's crazy. Man, that's a big monster hurricane that's coming at us in Florida right now. Are you looking at the Grace Jerk ch Chicken? Grace Jerk Seasoning? You know what, Brian? I think Gus was a good coach, man. Gus was a good coach did really good coach I, I don't understand why he got fired i get it at the end of the day it's all about um it's all about winning championships so i get it but um gus was a good coach We got Timothy, man. Um, I seen you made a video, man. You, um, do you make other videos, or that's the only video you made? What are you a basketball coach or something? Timothy, are you a basketball coach? Melissa up in the building right now. Melissa asks, "What's the co What's the score? The score is fourteen to six, Oregon Ducks. Right now, we at halftime. Right now. Oh, you're a basketball coach? Yeah, man, drop drop some more videos, man. You could blow up. You could blow up, man, showing them skills. The skills on um, if you show like show any of the skills, man, you can blow up on YouTube, man. A lot of people a lot of people want to watch stuff like that. You know? You'll definitely make more money, man. You'll definitely make some money, man. Um just make your videos, man. Like, 
on the stuff that like how to you know you know how to do all that coaching stuff like how to dribble the ball fast and how to do a crossover and how to how to rotate your hand when you shoot oh yeah i go for miami heat but we got i go for miami heat but hey we got jimmy butler <laughs> We got the butler. What what are we gonna do, man? We suck, bro. I, we should have we should have like not get Jimmy Butler and just kept rebuilding. Like I don't I don't. Oh, you say college team? Nah, I don't like college basketball. To be honest with you. And the reason why I don't like college basketball, man, it's too much. It's too many teams. I'm just, I get confused easy. Too many teams for me. I don't like it. Oh man, I want to finish. I want to finish watching this game, but I'm getting like really sleepy, yo. Like, be honest with y'all, people. I've been working since. I've been working since like 1:30 a.m. This morning or last night, whatever you want to call it. So I'm going to try to hang in as much as I could. I take it easy, Brian. I'm going to try to hang in as much as I could to watch the game. If not, I'm going to get out of here, man. <laughs> Appreciate everybody for joining, though. You know, that truck driving, truck, being a truck driver is not easy. Oh, how much I lose? No, I didn't, I didn't bet on the game. I did not bet on the game. No. Yeah, I ain't been on the game. Yeah. But if we got any YouTubers that's up in here, man, and y'all want to go live, we'll send some people over there right now. I'm about to go to sleep. I thought I was going to finish streaming this game, man, but then, yo. Tell you, this week, all the truck drivers in Florida are like working like super hard because in Florida right now the hurricane is coming. Everybody's ordering water. We're working our ass off. Crazy overtime. No free time. Yo, it's crazy right now. You know? I got all my water sitting over there. I right, take care of all the girl. Hello? Let me give y'all some updates and score before I get out of here. Okay, final stories. Story before I get we get out of here. We got Iowa on top of um Miami, Ohio, ten to seven at halftime. We got LSU. They're up on Georgia Southern, forty-five to three. We got the Texas Tech Longhorn, Texas Longhorn. They're winning twenty four to zero.
Yeah, division. Um, it's crazy, man. Everybody buying gas and stuff, filling up their generators, filling up their boats, filling up their cars. They just filling up everything, man. You know, it's crazy in Florida right now, people. It's crazy. Crazy in Florida, man. Y'all just pray for Florida. Hopefully, everything goes all right for us. You know. But yo, we about to get out of here. Make sure y'all subscribe to everybody. Uh, enjoy the rest of the game. Next week, I'm going to come through. I'm going to be well rested. Um, my team, next week, we're going um, we to be talking about my team. We're going to be going up against UNC if they show that on TV. Because I wouldn't show that crap on TV. So that's two sorry teams right now. But that's gonna be the game next week though that we're gonna be showing. So I'll make sure to tune in. But I appreciate everybody in here for joining me, man, for the first college football crap talk, whatever you wanna call it, junk talk. I appreciate y'all for joining me and make sure y'all take it easy out there. Have yourself a great day. Out. I'm waiting for one person to say it. I'm waiting before I leave. I'm waiting for one person to say it. say it later or something. Yeah, please join me next week. Please join me next week. All right, y'all take it easy.